Your boy wanna hold me South Florida Yep, he hit the real, it is the one I hit up I need a house on the beach, get some sun Palm trees, family, it's all I want Yes, 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 my friends. Hey, you already know what time it is. You know, it's Pierre Nicholson, your favorite realtor down here in beautiful South Florida. And today, I have a treat for you. Hey, I'm out here in the beautiful community of Arden. Brand new constructions from GL Homes. I'm looking at a special model called Monterey. Hey, take a look. Kaboom! Beautiful! Brand new construction. Hey, well, let me say, look, down here in Arden, they're building fast. They've sold over 90 homes. But listen, if you haven't already, hey, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified every time I, that's right, drop a new video. And if you're thinking about buying a house down here in beautiful South Florida, anywhere in West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, or Miami, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email. Even leave a comment down below and I'd be glad to help, okay, my friend? Look, look, I appreciate you a thousand percent. Enough of that. Let's get back to the house. Kaboom. All right, listen, man. This one is called the Monterey. It's a five-bedroom, five-bathroom with a lock, great room, converted patio, a covered patio, three-car garage, 3,299 square feet. Okay, we're looking at the coastal design elevation, which the starting price for that is 800 7,900. Let's see what we're getting for that money. This is the coastal design. So the starting price for the coast is 815, 900. And let's walk up to only an age away of $282, man. And let's walk up real quick. The premium, the lot premium start from zero to $28,000. Right, three car garage. You're building fast. So they're almost halfway completed already in less than a year. Let's go. Beautiful, man. Hey, just walking up to your house, man. There's no doubt that you're walking up to a house that is gonna meet your expectations. I'm loving this feature wall. Walking up to your house, you could do it like that. I'm liking how this pots, you know, how they did that. And, it's, and this is very wide, so it doesn't feel like you're walking down like a, a, like a small sidewalk. I would definitely obscure the windows. Wow, look at this. Soon as I walk in, I'm seeing double high ceilings, right, skip trout texture, and you have a beautiful area right here that you can put a drop zone, and I'm loving the wood on the wall. They, you know, it's a feature wall, right? Let's walk, walk through. High gloss floors, open railings, although this is the wood. Okay, I, you know, me personally, I love, I love the metal vibes, but you know, the wood is not bad. Here we go, the living area. It's something about high gloss floors, man. There you got this high gloss entertainment center. They floated you on it and gave you two side, side pieces as well. Okay. Beautiful. And then you have uh, almost like a little office area down here. Okay, you can put additional, you can put a desk, a, a, you know, a seat. Right, let's walk into the kitchen. Big, beautiful island. You can see for, I'm seeing a big undermount uh, sink, gooseneck faucet. Here is the pantry. But you have so much space here that, you know, that you could utilize more. Here go the fridge. Beautiful, this is the one with the freezer on the bottom. So this is one of the, uh, appliance packages that you could get GE right nice upper cabinets with the lights underneath it quartz countertop on the island too uh nice backsplash I like how they pair that you got a gas stove with uh, the wi-fi oven come on man who doesn't want a wi-fi oven somebody said is it is it soft clothes is it dovetail they don't play yourself, they dovetailed you and they soft closed you. And this is a wonderful company. Aristocraft, okay. 
I like Aristo Craft. I like, I, re I really like an Idol Craft. Okay, they got a branch in Miami as well. Beautiful dovetail, soft clothes, undermount sink, very deep by Moen. Okay, I don't see the push button the garbage disposal. So that means the switch is down here. And here go the GE dishwasher. Hey, seven to eight months, they'll be able to do a project from scratch. They have a, they have a couple of quick move-ins, meaning they got a couple of houses that already built it with beautiful upgrade upgrades, right? That you could just, if you want something now, you could, you could be in it within the next 30 days, okay? I'm loving the light fixture. This, this is a table for eight. And you can almost put a table here for 10. I tried to go out to the balcony earlier, they, they locked it. They locked it, so we're gonna have to look from right here. Cause you know, I'm definitely going outside. They go to the tanning area of the pool, let's go this way. I look how big this lot is. So you got extra meat down there. I wish I was down there so you could really see what I see. And this community is building fast. Hot tub that overflows into the pool. All right, let's continue down this way. So here go the AC. I would say a home like this is, it's around two zones. Okay, I wouldn't be surprised if they said one. I'm loving how the light placement, right? You got space down here. This That's the um, storage. This is to the garage. I think they might have locked it. Yep. Because sometimes they use it for storage. Let's walk to this bedroom down here. They got a bedroom downstairs, which I'm excited about because you could use that as an in-law suite if you wanted to. Right? Beautiful. Other mount sink. Quartz countertop. That quartz matches the quartz in the kitchen. Here we go, shower. M my thoughts are, let's put glass here, make it a shower tub conversion, make sure that glass is frameless. And I, I feel like, boom, it will elevate your house even that much more. Okay, even with the existing tile and everything, if you put the glass there, yeah. Okay. Then the closet. I'm loving the brush, uh, stainless steel finish on the faucet. Let's walk this way. Nice transition to the carpet. Carpet is very plush. Nitpick, my only thing is that I would make the floor go all the way through. I'm not really a carpet person, but you know, to each his own. Um, if you suffer from cold feet, then you know, carpet is your best bet. Nice walk-in closet. I would definitely put a built-in in here because it's big enough to do a nice, beautiful built-in. You got skip drop text on the ceiling. I'm love the light placement. Let me walk this way. I like the fact they don't place it in your face. It's like a waste when you turn it on. It just illuminates what you want to be illuminated. Beautiful. All right, let's continue. Let's go upstairs. I'm loving the light fixture. Look at that. Wow. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go upstairs. I love the transition to the wood. It's looking like engineered hardwood. Let me take my time and walk up the steps. Uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't feel concrete poured. I'm loving the wood. The simple things like the wood on the wall, it gives it like, it pops it even more. The, you know, the, the, the details, the small details. All right, I like the fact that, yeah, they bring the wood as a floor and upstairs. Beautiful loft area. Very spacious too. And I'm loving how the, the entertainment center uh, down here, how they floated it and very practical. I'm loving the open shelvedness of this. I don't know if you get this with a home cause this could be sometimes the interior designer do their own thing. But if you want to do no, call me and find out. Let's walk this way. Okay, this, this looks like the master suite. Let's walk this way real quick. Here go a uh, full bath in the hallway. And just take a look at that transition. I like a more seamless transition from wood to floor. That's when you know you have, that, that shows like a good. To me, the craftsmanship, if you could really level that floor with the tile, 
Like I see in some of the million dollar property, that's what, to me, I feel like you get the best craftsmanship, right? But everybody loves something different. Undermount sink, they're consistent with the quartz that's in the, you know, on the, in the kitchen. They put it in the bathroom. They go to niche. I'll definitely put glass on that tub. We'll enter in this bedroom over here. Here go that transition. Okay. They got this like a, you know, like a workout room, but you could definitely use this as a, as a bedroom. They go to closet, big fan. If you're using that as a workout room, then yeah, that fan is needed. I, I love the deepness of this hallway and it's pretty wide. Let's go over here first. So here go AC. So this house might just be two zones. Then here go that transition to this floor, this high gloss floor. Beautiful. Right, the, the laundry room got a window. Undermount sink by Kohler, gooseneck faucet. You got the top loader, washing machine, and they put the smart box. I don't mind the smart box being in the laundry room, but I wish the laundry room was downstairs because I don't want anybody coming up upstairs and working on my home. I'd rather be, that be in the garage or if it's in the laundry room, that the laundry room is downstairs. You know, that's my only five. Hey, look at this light fixture. It's a skateboard, I like that. My son will love that, right? I love the transition from the floor to the carpet, right? It's clean, it's nice, they've done it well. It's not my favorite type of transition. I like a seamless transition, like it's just smooth. Hey, these, these rooms, huh, their closets are pretty big, okay? You can put a, you can put a king size bed in here easy. Uh, the room is wide enough for it. And this room has views uh, at the front of the house. I like the fact they use the like quartz as a transition to this tile. Beautiful. Frameless mirror. Okay. You have a shower in here. All right. Let's continue. Okay, here we go, another room. And that room downstairs is not a massive suite. You definitely in-laws can stay in there or somebody that has trouble walking up the stairs. Or it could be a nice guest room, however you see it. Or down, that could be your workout room if you wanted to, you know? Whatever, it's, it's your house, do whatever, right? Under Mount Sink, frameless mirror, okay, tub, very deep closet. So I'm, I'm kind of curious to see what the master closet is gonna look like, cause these closets are pretty big. Let's continue. So we're walking up to the master bedroom. So here we go. Let's enter the master bedroom. Let's go. I'm loving the height of the doors. Wow. Yeah, this is a deep closet, right? Skip child texture. I love the placement of the light. You have attic access. You got uh, AC supply line. Let's, uh, is this another closet? Yes. So they gave you two closets his and hers, or clothes and shoes, however you want to do it. You can put some nice built-ins there in there easy. All right, let's go into the, the, the bathroom. Love the choice of wallpaper. Look at this wallpaper, man. It's textured, dual sinks. You got to make a vanity right there. Very spacious, frameless mirrors with the light fixture on the top. I like, I like that. It's very modern looking, very chic. Right, here go of the tub. Encased in the same tiling as the floor and the wall. Or in the shower, I should say. Here go the water closet. They took the door off right here. But you know, my water closet, I like, I like uh, if, if you can make it a pocket door, here go the pantry. I know you can't, you can't always do that. And that makes you appreciate the pocket door even more. Here we go. 
the shower, okay. Alright, let's make our way into the bedroom. We are in the bedroom. Let's make our way into the, you know, where the bed is at. Wow, I'm loving the, how the curtains go all the way across. Uh, although that's a wall and it's really supposed to be like one curtain, two curtain, three curtain. I like this because it, it kind of softens up that wall too. I'm loving the light fixture. Look at that. Hey, let me know if you like this light fixture. Very spacious room. Okay. Very nice. So yeah, man, that's about it. That is about it. Hey, let me know what you think in the comments below. But listen, thank y'all for rock with me. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified every time I, that's right, drop a new video. And if you're, look, if you wanted to buy a home down here in beautiful South Florida, anywhere in West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, and Miami, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email, even leave a comment down below and I'll be glad to help. But the easiest way to go in the description and click on schedule a call. All right, my friend, I appreciate you a thousand percent. Listen, you know it's your favorite agent, Pierre Nicholson, to the next property. On the beach, get some sun Palm trees, family, it's all I want That's all I really want, all I really need South Florida living on my TV New videos out weekly Kaboom, I think I found the one I want, baby yeah. A new start, a new life, a new home Miami, Fort Lauderdale, and West Palm If I want a home in South Florida Yeah, Pierre, the real it is a